from pointing a laser at a player's eye to tying an opponent's shoes together. These are 20 NBA cheating moments. And Dwayne Wade noticed his opponent lost their shoe, so he took it and threw it out of bounds. Man, uh, D-Wade's soulless for cheating like that. And so is Draymond Green, cause one time he snuck into another team's huddle and tried to steal their play. Yeah, you gotta keep your eyes on this guy. Rajon Rondo pulled off an all-time cheating moment when, during the other team's free throw, he used his own sweat to make the ball slippery. Ugh, Jesus, that's disgusting. Now, Russell Westbrook has had some dumb moments over the years, and there's no better example than the time he forgot the NBA's most important rule, dribbling. And a travel call. Man, that wasn't even a travel, that was a full-blown journey. But we're journeying on to Draymond Green, cause he cheated by sitting on DeMontis Sabonis. Man, they really got off on the wrong foot. But Jason Terry got a man on the wrong team, cause while he was on the bench, he managed to help his team score by distracting J.R. Smith. The Cavs have to do one thing though with the, the Adam Kumbo. Oh man, I'm so excited. Yeah, just watch the top left. You can see Jason Terry distracting JR, so his team gets a free bucket. Man, you can't trust anyone, and definitely not Karam Butler, cause with the game basically over, it seemed like he wanted to dap up Jonas Valanciunas. But that's when this happened. I'd love for you to describe for folks what's going on here in a game that you're losing by 27 points. Jonas Valanciunas has the ball, and there you are, you're gonna high give five, him a little high five. <laughs> and you <laughs> You took the ball. There's two seconds left in the game. What are you doing? Respect hey, the game. All that just to lose by 25. Well, that's petty. But hey, some people will do anything to win. Like the Raptors player who exposed himself during a game. Well, damn. That's one way to distract your opponent. But sometimes, entire teams resort to cheating. Because the 76ers once played a game with six guys on the court rebounds. But again, you watch this, and, and Bork Boss from the corner drains another three. Was there six guys on, on the court for Philly at one point? Yeah, there's six on the floor. Yeah, yeah. Six on five. Game's a little easier in that respect. Huh. Well, I guess they call them the Sixers for a reason. And they might have had an extra man. But the Bulls mascot had an extra girl. Because Benny the Bull was caught cheating on his girlfriend live on the KISS cam. Damn, my boy Benny got caught, that's crazy. Fine, this next cheating moment is stupid. Cause in the middle of a game, JaVale McGee looked like he got injured. But just a few seconds later, he saw his real intentions. New Chase Center in San Francisco. Here's McGee from Davis. Man, this dude just faked an injury to get a basket. That's love. But look, some players stoop even lower. Literally. Cause Markel Fultz untied a man's shoe during a game. Markel Fultz reached down and untied Terrence Ross shoe. Man, Markel's tripping. But LaMelo Ball is shameless. Cause he pulled off one of the worst flops I've ever seen. Any pressure on the guy taking the ball out of bounds. And Lakers need to down. They're not fouling him. They do. As Westbrook pushes Ball and Ball takes a tumble. Melo, come on. That was just dumb. But how Avery Bradley cheated was genius, because he pretended that his shoe was untied and did this. All night, 12 of 19 from the field and a steal. Three on one. Bobs it up for Hollins, and Hollins. Well, well, that's thinking on your feet. But anyways, we gotta talk about Andre Drummond, because this man was caught cheating by faking an injury. Tell you what, that was a that was an effort play right there. That was an effort play. 
Big Cat. Hey, the big, big Cat. Drummond. Damn, I'm going to call him Andre Dummond after that. Well, I'm going to call the Thunder smart for this next play, because they had their mop boys on the court playing defense. As McLaughlin, he got blocked by the cleanup crew on the floor, missed the shot, and Waters cleans up the miss. Man, talk about getting an advantage any way you can. Now, that's something that Utah Jazz know about. Because while James Harden was at the free throw line, some crazy fan shined a laser right in his eye. And now a whistle before Harden shoots. J.B. Bickerstaff, their interim head coach, says it's a, it's a laser pin. Now, you can't do that at a game. But I don't know how you spot this individual. Man, they were really trying to blind Harden. But Rockets fans aren't innocent either. Because during a free throw, they tried to distract the Pelicans by doing this. Oh my goodness. Would that distract you? No. <laughs> Dr. Seuss, come on. I don't think that's what he had on, on his mind. All right, if that's cheating, I don't want to play fair. And neither do the Brooklyn Nets, because in our final moment, they sent out their secret weapon, Nets super fan, Mr. Wham, who pulls up to every home game with one mission, put a curse on the other team. And he's done it to everyone. Fred Van Vliet, Giannis, Julius Randle, and finally, Kyle Lowry. What do you do as Mr. Whammy uh, in the house here in Brooklyn? <laughs> a staple here uh, in Brooklyn. Clean the Whammy out. There you go, Mr. Whammy. Didn't work on the first one. Let's see if it pans out here for him. He got him. It's all him. It oh, he's not again. Damn, Grandpa. Once a cheater, always a cheater. Well, look, there's more than just cheating going on in the league. Because the NBA is full of beautiful moments, too. Like Russell Westbrook giving a fan a car, or John Morant giving a kid his unreleased shoes. Look, if you want to smile, do you need to click on this video right here. These are the most beautiful moments in NBA history. And, uh, this video's over, so what are you doing? Uh, just click it. Click it.